Allentown, was this always you? Were you always this big personality? Um, no. Um, and actually, I was very, very shy, which I think there's a lot of people who have like big personalities now who like had a shy kind of childhood. And um, yeah, I was a very timid kid. And uh, elementary school, it was like a little fashion plate. And I got the Calvin Klein jeans like in 1979. And the other kids were like, who are you? And I was like, I'm pretty fierce. Um, <laughs> And then I feel like in junior high, which is very challenging, yeah. um, especially for a gay kid in the rural, rural suburbs of Allentown, like Amish adjacent is how I would describe it. Yes. Um, you could hear butter churning in the distance. And, um, but I learned that if I was the class clown and I had a big personality and I was kind of um, one step ahead of everybody, I would not get bullied and I wouldn't get picked on and I could kind of deflect. So. Uh, what could have been, you know, a, a lemon situation, I made into a tasty lemon margarita. But so, so thanks, you, haters. I know, right? So you experienced the haters then. But I read that that yeah. you were not out to your family at that. No, time. So no, you were dealing with it in school, right? But not at home. And, uh, you know, I've talked to a lot of LGBTQ youth, um, and I think that common thread, um, growing up, you know, as a gay kid, is that if you get tortured at school or bullied or picked on or just made to feel less than or like you don't fit in, you're very hesitant about coming home and sharing it with your family and your most loved inner circle because you're afraid that they won't accept you either. Then they tell you we're launching this show. Yes. You're faced with the fact that I'm now about to be out to, to the world. Everybody. Yes. And still hadn't officially had that conversation with your family. No, I hadn't. And wow. literally, I think the show was coming out like on a Tuesday. We were going to be on the cover of the TV guide like on a Saturday. And I was just like, I better get back to Allentown and have the conversation, uh, which I did and everything was fine. Mm -hmm. And, you know, coming out for people, it's everybody does it at their own time and needs to feel supported. Um, and my family was amazing um, and very conservative. And so I wasn't sure, but they wound up being amazing and they, you know, have been so proud of me. The show was out 20 years ago. It's our 20th anniversary Crazy. year. And I'll meet people who are like, you know, 30 on an airplane. They'll say, oh my gosh, I watched your show with my mom. I didn't know if she was going to accept me. And it made my coming out so much easier. My dad was super conservative. I watched with him. He thought you were really funny. You were the first gay person he ever like knew. Um, and it made my journey easier. So those are the best moments um, from the show. And then personally, it forced me to come out and be very, very authentic. And um, so that was a blessing as well.